Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my little corner where today we've got another Stitch Fix box. I actually requested some New Year's Eve outfits in this box. Um, I think by the time you guys are getting it, it might be a little too late, but we know that, you know, Valentine's Day is coming up and glam kind of goes along with that. So I thought it'd be really fun to share this with you guys. I think it's my 27th box. I think so. <laughs> Without any further ado, let's go ahead and dive right in. So if you haven't heard of Stitch Fix, it's a subscription in which you pay $20. That $20 gets credited to whatever you decide to keep out of your box. You can do exchanges if things don't fit you as far as your sizing. They send you clothing, accessories, shoes. It's really exciting. I love Stitch Fix. Not to mention I have the best stylist there ever was, Alexandra. So um, without any, I already said that, didn't I? Let's see what's in the box. Oh, and just so I don't forget to mention, there's a link down below. So if you guys use that link, you'll get $25 off your first fix, and I will get $25 credit towards my next box. I don't have a ton of credit for this box. I don't remember how much, maybe 60 bucks? So maybe I get to keep one piece for free thanks to you guys using my link, so I really do appreciate it. I have $61.37 credit inside this box, so hopefully if I like something, I can afford to keep it. Um, inside your box you will always have your return shipping bag as well that's already pre-labeled as well as your bundles and any extras that you get which I believe I got an extra in this one as well as your pricing sheet and style card. So I'm going to grab my style card and I'm going to read my little note from Miss Alexandra and see if I was right about this being Stitch Fix number 27. Yes, it is. <laughs> I see it right at the beginning. Happy Stitch Fix Day, Karen. I'm thrilled to be styling your 27th box and I couldn't be more excited for the pieces that I have picked out for your New Year's Eve plans. I cannot wait for you to try this pleated faux leather mini skirt from Vera Moda. I'm dying over this piece and I know it will knock your husband off of his feet. You mentioned wanting something sexy and this skirt is exactly that. Keep the top more classic and chic by wearing this skirt with your new neutral pullover. Give it a small half tucked off the center look. I hope that makes sense. It does because I do it all the time. I know exactly what you're talking about. And add a pair of velvet booties. Add a little New Year's Eve sparkle with these crystal stud earrings. I also included this gorgeous foil printed blouse that definitely has that New Year's glam. Keep it a little more low key and casual by wearing your favorite skinnies. Happy New Year, Alexandra. So, okay, New Year's Eve plans have changed a tad. <sighs> Alexandra, in my style note, I told you that I was gonna go out and I was gonna say goodbye 2019, hello 2020, by having a good time, pretending that I am still young, reminding my husband that he is still young. But my Benjamin Button of a husband, wants to stay home which is fine i'm still gonna clean him up i'm still gonna have a good time i'm trying to now talk him into having a couple of couples over so that we can have a good time with other people um without the crowds and the drinking and having to deal with uber and all that so fingers crossed for that i will need a cute outfit not to mention i just got my hair done i got hand tied extensions so i really want to like enjoy it and look cute so, okay, let's go ahead and get into this bag. We'll check out the pricing once we've tried everything on. First off, I added an extra in. This is, ooh, I don't remember. We'll check it out on the tag. <laughs> but I like the way that they packed it up. It says extra comfort, extra support, extra nice. So this is like a little cami PJ set, if I remember correctly. It is the by Seeing Stars, lace cami, short, and PJ set in black. So I might, <laughs> Probably won't try this one on for you guys, but we'll definitely try on myself off camera. It's just really, really short booties and a little um, booties, <laughs> booty shorts and a little cami. So I just don't feel like it's gonna be uh, enough coverage for me to do it on camera. But it does look super cute, really, really comfortable, and I need something like this. So I'll have to set that aside and know that I'm probably gonna dig this. Now our buckle. Oh, I am loving that texture right there. That is so cool. I can't wait to dive in. I actually just told my husband, maybe I'll get a green shirt in here because the whole family's wearing green today. We're doing our second Christmas. It's a Geiger Christmas um, and we're doing it at a friend's house, Alex, that went on the cruise with us. And I need a green shirt and I like this. It's super cute. It's got cute sleeves. It's well covered, but it's got a ruffle at the bottom. 
So it's got this little ruffle at the bottom and I keep tugging at it and pulling at it and I feel like it's gonna drive me nuts all night. It is super cute though. Anyway, so I told my husband maybe I'll get a green shirt in there and I see a green something. <laughs> maybe it's a skirt, but we'll see. We'll check it out. Okay. So the first item in my bundle is a very glittery one. Oh, I love that. <gasps> gonna be in so much trouble that is so cute this is the west key allen surplus foil print blouse in black size medium i die for that that would look really cute with a pair of skinny jeans i don't currently have skinny jeans on and i'm just gonna try this stuff on with whatever i have on so please be a blouse please be a blouse i think you are it is the bixby gwen tie front boss in teal green size medium Still works. <laughs> I think that is so cute. I have a feeling I'm gonna keep this one. Ooh, I'm gonna be in so much trouble. Okay, moving on. The next thing is by 818 is the brand, and it is the Pax Lace Up Detail Pullover in beige. Oh, oh, I love this. Oh my goodness, that is so cute, and it feels like the softest blanket. I love that. And then the skirt. That's what that, um, like, leathery, sorry, didn't mean to, like, hit you in the face with the pullover, but that's what that, like, leathery feeling material is. It is the Vera Moda Jaslyn Pleated Faux Leather Mini Skirt in black. I don't think I've worn, oh, that's not too bad. I saw, I heard mini and thought, oh my god, that's gonna be, like, super duper small. Um, we do have a little bit of a fold in the pleating from where it was packaged, but I think it'll still look really cute, especially if that's, yeah, that's the back. So, I don't know, we will try it on. So I'm gonna go ahead and start throwing some outfits together and I'll be right back with you guys. All right, my love, so I have the first top on. It is so sparkly, I absolutely love it. I do have a little tank on underneath it, but that's not even necessary. I just have it on because I had it on and it was the easiest. So cute, I love the ties, I love the sleeves. I love the material. It feels so nice, doesn't show too much. It's still, that's what I told her, like I wanna be sexy, but I also wanna be covered. So this is super cute. I have a feeling this is gonna make this very, very hard. We have so many cute pieces. I'm gonna go ahead and grab that other green top and hope and pray that it's like perfect for tonight. All right, so I have the Bixby blouse on. It's way more comfortable than the other top that I was wearing for tonight. But I don't know if this one like really, really says Christmas. I feel like the other one looks more Christmassy, as comfortable as this is. I love the animal print on it. I think it's really cute. It reminds me of Victoria's Secret. It feels really comfortable. Sleeve length is absolutely amazing. I have nothing bad to say about it. I was just hoping that, I don't know, that it would replace that uncomfortable but severely cute top that I was wearing. Okay, last but not least, I'm going to do two things. Well, I guess it's not last, but is it? I'm going to go ahead and try on the cami set, see if I love it, and then I'm going to come back to you guys in the faux leather pleated skirt and the pullover. Okay, so I've decided to go ahead and show you guys the PJ set because it has a built-in bra, and it's actually really comfortable and covered, but also kind of cute. I love it. I knew I would because it's the same material as the other pajama set. I may be in trouble here, guys. Okay guys, so I'm back with you in the skirt and the pullover, the pullover I absolutely love. The skirt is just not for me. I don't wear a lot of skirts. I feel a little bit out of place in it. It's like that vest last time. The vest was amazing. I absolutely loved it, but it just didn't suit me. This is like that. It's so cute, but I feel like I would just be uncomfortable in the whole thing. Let me show you guys the rest of the pullover though so you can see how cute it is. Super freaking cute. Okay, I love the skirt, actually. I just, I don't know, man. I can't love this whole dang fix. I can't afford it. What do I do? But anyways, back to the pullover. I love the crisscross detail on the sleeve. It doesn't expose any, any like skin, but it's there, it's texture. I love it. I love the ribbed sleeves and how long they are. I love the ribbing at the bottom. It is a very, very comfortable and cute sweatshirt. Pullover, I love it. Okay, guys. <laughs> I think I like it all. Like, all of it. And I can't like it all. I can't. I only have $61 credit. Um, <laughs> so, we're going to have to make some really, really tough and hard decisions. I'm going to need the assistance of the pricing sheet to make these decisions. 
Um, because I honestly, when I got the box, I was like, I'll just keep the extras and oh, I forgot about the jewelry. I almost totally forgot about the jewelry. I thought it was a little light on pieces. Um, <laughs> oh, those are pretty. These are by Stella and Ruby. <laughs> they all look so cute. I'm not even gonna put them in. I'm not, I'm not gonna do that. Because at this point, I've already fallen in love with all the other pieces and I don't wanna fall in love with you. I don't wanna do it. <laughs> it's so pretty. I'm putting you back in your box. Okay. <laughs> Now that I'm done being dramatic, I'm gonna take a look at my style card and see what she recommends. Kind of with each piece, I love that it gives you these options and shows you like what would look best. Oh man, oh man, Alexandra. Dang it, my gun, George. Where's that thing for us and she? Hiding from me now, because it doesn't want to upset me. It's like she's not gonna like this, guys. Okay. Here we go, guys. Let's do this piece by piece. These earrings that I undoubtedly cannot afford. <laughs> These Stella and Ruby Katy, Katy, I don't know. Crystal stud earring, $28. Actually, not that bad. They're really, really cute too. Okay, and then the first thing I see on here is the leather skirt that I still have on because it's actually kind of cute and comfy, <laughs> is $58. The Bixby Gwen tie front blouse, that's this little green number. This one's $40. There's another top in here that is $40 and it is, just kidding, it's $44. And it is the Allen Surplus, 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 foil print blouse. I believe that is this shiny little number here. It's by West Key. It is black. It is forty-four dollars. <laughs> and then we have. Wait, is that everything? Oh, this. <laughs> then we have the eighteen eight eighteen Pax lace up detail pullover beige, forty-six dollars. So all the tops are about the same price range, right? Forty dollars, forty-four, forty-six earrings 28 and the skirt 58 being the most expensive thing in the box because the lace PJ Kimmy set that I love is $42 which is kind of expensive for like just shorts and cami so I think I'm gonna send that back. <laughs> so I think what we're gonna do I'm actually gonna send back the PJ oh my god no. am I sending back the PJ set or am I going to oh uh. I think I like this top more and I'm gonna keep the PJ set. <laughs> I am so indecisive. I'm gonna keep the PJ set, I'm gonna keep the foil top because I feel like that's a great at home, sparkly little number to wear on New Year's Eve. And that's what I'm gonna do. The green top's so cute and I wanna keep it, but I'm not gonna wear it tonight. And <sighs> enough said. I'll be spending $86, but with a $61 credit off of that. So like $25, a little bit less not bad for PJ and Akami. Thank you guys so much for using my links and for hooking me up because I would not be able to afford all of this so I really appreciate it. I should probably also mention, because I forgot and had to add this in later, um, that if you do keep all of the items inside your fix, you would get a 25% discount. That discount in this box, because my box total is $216, would be $54. So if I wanted to keep everything credits aside, it would be $204. Oh, that was so hard. <laughs> Alexandra, you gotta start making it easier on me, okay? Like throw in a couple of Uggs every once in a while, please. All right, guys, that is it. I'm gonna go ahead and let you go. This has been a nice, fun Stitch Fix video to do right before I have my second Christmas. So thank you guys so much for joining me. If you liked today's video, give me a big old thumbs up. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. And speaking of new subscribers, one of the things that I love doing on my channel is just saying hello to my new peeps in the weirdest way possible, because that's how I roll. So hello, <laughs> I lost my voice, Gracie Newsom, Lauren Weaver, and Alyssa Gold, thank you guys so much for joining my little group of crazy little misfits. I really do appreciate you. If you're watching right now, make sure you say hi. And either way, thank you guys so, so much for watching today. I hope you have a lovely, lovely day, and I'll see you very soon. Bye.